Hello and welcome to our Getting Started with Slack series. My name is Travis Allison from GoCamp.pro. So when you open Slack on your device, you're going to be asked to sign in for by your team name. Um, and you can see it's already created in there, .slack.com. So you have to make sure it's not just, it's exactly as the domain looks when you open up Slack in a browser. For us, that um, on the membership site, that's GoCamp.pro. Um, and continue and then I'll sign in with my email address and finally I'll part in my password. The cool thing about Slack is if you have a complicated password, which I do, um, you can receive a link in an email that will sign you in. It double checks to see um, that your name, your email address is a member and that it will send you a quick link. So I'm going to put my password in here and then we'll get started with using it on my mobile device. So you can see from here that it looks very similar on my Apple device, on my iPad, um, compared to what we saw on the screen, which is using the Mac app. We even got Oprah being happy on here. So the channels are on the left-hand side. You can pick a different one, go on, 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 et cetera. It's all there. Um, and you can see that I have new messages in um, these different channels because they've shown up in bold. So there's information there. So I can pick a channel to get started, uh, etc. I like that it highlights the unread channels. So this is all stuff that um, that you've looked at before. So go back to getting started. So if you are a member of more than one team, you can go over here and switch teams at the bottom. You can also do the searches, go by at mentions, the different files, etc. It's all available. You can also direct message someone like Laura um, from here, and away I go. It's all in there, ready to go. So I just just use it the same as anything. It searches up at the top, and we're ready to go. Really, it is very similar to the desktop app, so it's not that complicated to use. But this will be, again, the way that you use um, this probably most often. So if you want to change notifications, you pull the pull down arrow and push notification settings is the thing that does notification on the device that you have in your hand. So you can start a channel or change your notification settings, all that within your mobile device. So really all the stuff you need to use Slack is available on your mobile device. Um, and it's great to, uh, to have that all available there. So thank you very much for watching. My name is Travis Allison from gocamp.pro.